fans. Bernie, what up, champ? Coach. What's good, family? How y'all? Oh, we happy, man. We happy. We over here. We right. over here celebrating. We gonna see you in fifty eight days. Yeah, for sure. Let's for sure. It. Uh, well, I was calling in because I got a little time to sit while we sitting around at work, and then I I uh, seen your post about Ness saying Lomachenko he not that big of a star because I guess Bob Aaron put him over there. Well, I had to think of this. Uh, I wouldn't say that. I think he's a huge star. But I think that, you know, boxers is hard. It's hard to become a huge star, and pretty much anything really. Um, you know, you have to do have to do a little bit more publicity, maybe more to get out in the public eye, to put you in somewhere to get to that. So I say this, you know, I think it's smart move by top rank to put him over there. But again, you got to think, even though Lomachenko got the right complexion, he's still a foreigner. So you got to think about that. Then I was thinking too. Uh, you know, boxers used to fight on regular television. You know, the stars that are, you know, the big stars of the 80s and the 70s used to fight on regular television. You know, fighters these days, they don't fight that much. So it's hard to get recognized more outside of a big fight. And, and that's few and far between. And uh, like I said, you know, like Marvin Hagler, you know, he had the right guard commercial or the whatever commercial we had, you know, but. He, he was in the mainstream, you know, to, to be, and he still wasn't even as huge as star as Sugar Ray Leonard. So I think, you know, it's just hard for a boxer to, to become like a mainstream star. Everybody not going to do that. Like, uh, if you go watch Mayweather's, even when he was fighting, he fought Victoriano Sosa, and uh, he was the lightweight champion. He was a huge star, already had been a star. They got the Mayweather name and did everything, but he was only drawing 4,000 people. Watch the telecast and watch uh, Larry Merchant. What he say? I mean, it's only it's only about four thousand people here, and he thinks that he be- deserve a lot more. But like I say, it's only four thousand people here. So even though he was a superstar, huge in boxing, he wasn't. A, you know, he had to do something else to, to, to become a, a star. Uh, but Bernie, you 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 basically made. Hold on, my- hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me. Uh, you making my case, Chad. Go ahead. I'm saying you making my case. Like everything you saying is helping my debate that Loma is not a star. They could tell us he's a star till they face turn blue, but if you only in the small room, homie, it ain't you. Hmm. Well, That's I would. Uh, well, I, to say a star in the, in the like public, no. Uh, of course, he's not a star. Again, he's a foreigner. You know, but, but he's but, a superstar in boxing. But listen, we have mm-hmm. foreigners come here all the time in New York City and sell out the garden. Look mm-hmm. it up. Anybody who's Irish, anybody who's Puerto Rican. No, don't tell me. Who? I'm telling you. Anybody so that's Irish. I'm not naming a name now. Oh, come okay, on now. Okay, okay. In the last 10 years, Bo, give me give me an Ireland dude that was signed a top rank because we know he was there. Conlon. Conlon. Look him up. Has he not main event in, in Madison Square Garden? But give me another he did, one. But he not give a me, star. Give me another one. I'm he not but, a star. But he's selling more tickets than Loma. So if you telling me dudes that selling more I, tickets I than Loma, not stars, Loma definitely ain't a star. I don't believe. I don't believe that. But Bernie, how can't you, you believe you, it? Wrong, one dude, no, I, no, it's wait, easy wait, to wait. answer. It's easy to answer. One dude in a small room. Kodo don't okay, fight in the Kodo don't fight in the little room at the garden. He fight in the big garden. He ain't fighting okay, that Kodo was an American. Room. Kodo was born in Rhode Island. Kodo used his Puerto Rican heritage to sell tickets. Kodo was born in Rhode Island. Okay. He's not born in Puerto he don't Rico. He speak a lick of English. This one, I'm wait. He was reared in this country. He was brought up in this country. He's in, again Puerto Rico, right? He didn't sell out in L.A. He didn't sell out in Louisiana. He didn't sell out in New Atlanta. They put them in Puerto Rico where all the Puerto Ricans is at in New York. Okay. All right. I'm and, waiting now. And and he still got to the big room. Yo, Lomachenko is 34 years old, man. Like, you've been telling us he's a star since he busts on the scene. He ain't done a fucking pay-per-view yet. You defending this okay. dude, I don't know why. He ain't no, no star. Listen. He ain't okay, no star. Listen. Nothing he's nothing that he taught. Nothing he do show stardom. 
not his paycheck, not his non-pay-per-view fights, nothing. Okay, okay, now listen. Now, first, he ain't got no pay-per-view because he ain't had no dance partner. Not my problem. Not my problem. Tank ain't got no fucking dance partner. He on pay-per-view every week. So stop that lie. Now, now hold on, hold on, hold on. Now, 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 listen. Tank, you gotta understand. Tank knocked people out. Oh, now, now, now you pushing the goalposts back because now, now you, now, now you can knock people out and get on pay per view. So, yes. so, so I thought Loma yes. was a star. I thought he was the greatest yes. fighter since motherfucking Floyd Mayweather and Muhammad Ali. That's listen, what they told now, us. But these, now wait, hold on. It, now listen, just because, just because it's a, it's a violinist out there that I do not know. It's a now that motherfucker could be cold as everything else, could be best since Mozart, but I don't know. That don't mean that they not a star. So like I say, uh, uh, Tank is the whole dip. You got to think about what makes them a star in the different categories. Now, Tank, like I say, he knocking people out. That's it. That's that's what they want to see. He knocking people out. It, who going who gonna, to who gonna reach that? Now, his his thing going to wane if he don't fight nobody tough. His shit going to fall off if he don't fight nobody uh, uh, of substance. His shit gonna fall off. <laughs> they've been so, saying so like that, say, but bro, they've been saying he gonna fall off if he don't fight nobody of such since Ricardo Nunez. Man, knock it off. I Tank could do what he wants, because... like Canelo. You okay, know it, listen. and I know it. Tank could do anything he wants, just like Canelo. Tank could fight Isaac Cruz in December. We okay. He could rematch Roley. We okay. He could fight Ryan. We okay. He could That's fight Devin. True. We okay. Man. That's not true. Okay, All right. now, wait. Hold All on. Right. Hold on. Nah, don't get to talking like no. Nah. He can fight Cruz because that's almost like when Castillo fought Mayweather's. And everybody got a little controversy about that. And how, Cruz did not How, Sway? How? He beat the boy with one hand. And you want to give him a rematch? Hold on, you wait. trying to get that boy listen, killed. Okay. Listen, wait, we betting the listen, knockout. Hold on. Man. We betting the listen, knockout. I, listen, I didn't. Listen, wait. See, I didn't come on here to argue with you, oh, man. No, but listen, that's just not, my listen, nature. Listen, you're not under, I know, and it's annoying. You're not understanding <laughs> what I'm saying. Listen. The public, a lot of people think that Isaac Cruz gave that man a great fight. So at the sense, even the homies was like, man, he was giving Tank a fight. Everybody been saying that. Bruh. The tank didn't knock him out. Bruh. Again, so I'm not, I'm saying. Bernie, to cut the them boxing, homies man, off. Cut them homies off, man. Because you should have been telling them homies, bro, he beat that boy's ass with one hand. What do you think he's going to do said, with two? I said that. I said that. But this is what I'm trying to tell you. The perception of the fight. He lasted. He gave Tank a good fight. That's what I'm saying. Ain't nobody else gave him a good fight, right? We still saying the same thing, Bernie. We still saying the same thing. And what we saying is Tank could fight Isaac Cruz and nobody going to be mad. Isaac Cruz got two losses on his resume but and he, he never beat a world-class fighter. Listen, hold on. Castillo had a couple losses before he fought Mayweather's, but he gave him such a hell of a fight. That he did. Bruh. Maidana did the same thing. He lost to Devin Alexander. Did nobody give a fuck? He lost to J uh, Jab Judy. He got out box. No, that was Matisse. I disagree, he man. Lost to, he lost to Devin Alexander, but he still got the he got the win. He got the, he gave Mayweather's a lot of trouble. So of course he got the next fight. A lot of people thought he won the fight, even after he after the fight he thought he won the fight. He acted as though he won the fight. So Mayweather thought it was impressing on him to make the rematch. And of course Mayweather. He sell so of course they want to make the fight. He cannot fight Roley and get away with that. He can't. He can't. So um, don't say that. Now, I, disagree. Ryan, I disagree. I disagree. Fight Ryan because he got the. But be, listen, no, Bernie. Wait, no, let's put in context. It is in context because you overlooking the fact that Roley and 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 Tank did good numbers. So when you do good numbers, but he knocked him silly. And he outclassed him through and, the whole time. And, and before, he outclassed him no, for six rounds and he knocked no, him out. No, no. Oh. If you want to talk okay, about... Okay, I'm not going to argue with you, man. Cause if I, you want to talk about perception, if you want to talk about no. perception, the perception was that Roley had Tank on the back foot. So, oh, so on, he landed the counter. You know what I'm saying? So what? And Roley he and, got it done and, in and Roley, Roley was selling it to the, to the, to the, in the post fight. Like, yo, I was winning every round. He was scared of me. He caught me with a shot. You know what I'm saying? I, I, think they could sell it. And I think they could sell Come it. On, I man. think they could sell it, man. You going I mean, you gonna tell me we ain't seen worse rematches? We ain't need we ain't need the Floyd Name, name, name a worse rematch. Floyd Name Mayweather. a worse rematch. Uh fuck, man. 
Let me see. Who got a way? Who got a worthless rematch? He can put me on the spot here. Mm. Bo, you can't help me. So, like I, I say, <laughs> so like I say, you know, uh, it's hard to be a star in boxing, you know. But Loma Chico star, and like I say, you know, a lot of people hate on him like they oh, hate on I got Canelo. it, I got it, I got it, Bernie. Shit, I ain't even had oh, to look. I ain't even had to look too far. Worthless, oh. worthless rematch. Devin Haney, Cambosos. Say you don't agree. Say you don't fucking agree. Worthless rematch. AJ versus motherfucking Usyk. Worthless rematch. Say you no, don't agree. On, wait, no, 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 no. Wait. Come on, bruh. First of all, hold on. Wait. First of all, first of all, uh, Joshua, he's still a big star. Even, I mean, they still making him big star. Canelo Triple G3. Uh, say you don't agree. Okay. Hold on. Wait. Now, that, those was phone. mere formalities. They was already said in. Wow, the first set. of Vern and, too. Say you don't agree. And they had. And they, and they had and they had two great, they had two great, hold on, we got to take it one step at a time. Canelo and Triple G had two two fights, two good fights, and they had to sell the, the third fight as a, you know what it was, the business part. Y'all always talking business. They had to do that. There was no way they could get around that. They had to do that when they but, signed the contract. But we knew, we contract. knew what it hold was. On. We knew what it now, was. Listen. Okay, we knew we Triple G was know, old. We, we did know what it was. We did know what it was, but like I say, they couldn't get out of that. The only way he could have get out as he substituted Triple G for a different fight, maybe, and then they Bernie, couldn't get out of that. Because Bernie, they I got another contract. one for you. Berto versus Ortiz too. Ain't nobody asked for that shit. But Berto and Ortiz wasn't stars like that. But they wasn't. But those, when bro, they fought, bro, right? bro, when the, they fought, the argument was worthless rematches. Worthless okay. rematches. Okay. Now listen, but we should be talking about of substance. Now we got to keep things in context. Tank is of substance. Tank, tank is right now. Tank is relevant. When them guys fought, they wasn't relevant, so that's that shouldn't be counted. Of course, it should. I mean, Chavez uh, Taylor, the third fight, that was worthless. Come on now, but that they wasn't relevant at the time. So we talking about relevancy. So I'm saying he can't fight this uh, Roley in a rematch because everybody didn't think Roley had a chance in the first place. He got knocked out. That was it. Tank took his time against Santa Cruz. Everybody thought he was down in that fight. So listen, we know Tank can get me, get down and he'll come back, excuse me, and knock you out. Now, as far as relevancy in the fight, again, being a star, Tank knocks people out. That's his that's his moniker of knocking people out. So just like it, it don't matter who he was, just like they was hyping Berlanga until he got the they found out he really wasn't what he is. So when you get when you get it's it's a, it's a gimmick that you got to give. Now, boxing been an ethnic thing since beginning of time. You know, the Jewish guys used to run it. The Italians used to have it. They used to have rivalries with that, and there used to be a th fifty thousand Italians in the motherfucker mixed with Jews in the motherfucker. Not a Negro hardly in sight. Not a Mexican in sight. You understand? So it's a it's a it's a it's an ethnic thing, and it's hard to cross over. Boxing is put down probably twentieth on the list. Of sports, anyway, they gonna put everybody else first. Like I say, now then you go. It's hard to be a a a, a, a star in any sport. You don't have to do something extra exceed to to be a, a a superstar in the sport. And I think uh, outside of the sport, let me say that. And, and with a boxer, like I say, they don't put them on Wheaties no more. They don't give them no. They don't put them on no commercial. They don't give them either. The managers ain't doing their job. Or the public just don't want nah, you the know. boxer ain't he, doing his job. The boxer not doing his job. Because well, like Ryan, say, Ryan but, on a commercial on Gatorade with Damon Miller, Dillard or whatever. The, I don't watch them sports, but he on yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. They so did that. Tell, they the, boxer, did that. They tell did. the boxer to step it up. Because Jake, Jake, Jake Paul, Logan Paul, when they box, they got the biggest endorsements in boxing. So, you know, tell the boxer to step they it right. up. But they don't have no step, nah, no no talent. Nah, because they white. Nah, nah. Because they white. Okay, hold on. Now wait, hold on, wait. Now nah, wait a minute. So, Devin okay. Haney, Devin Haney had a Dapper Dan outfit on. He ain't white. You could get Devin Haney wore a gallery outfit to, and to and as he still his, ain't, and he still ain't nobody. Okay. And he still ain't nobody. In, in your opinion, but gallery sponsored his outfit, did they not? 
So you tell those other you tell those other fighters that ain't got no fucking major sponsors like Gallery and Gatorade to get on a goddamn game. Okay, listen, that's fine. I mean, I don't care about the sponsor, but listen, you he got a sponsor. Okay. Devin Haney's still the most disrespected, undisputed champion in history, probably. You right. De- Devin Haney's still probably. He only 23, uh, though. Let me, let he me, only 23, say, bro. Hold on, wait. Huh? He only 23. He got he got uh, plenty, I know, listen, I he got plenty that, of time to change listen, everybody. Uh, wait, well, hold on. You said he only 23. Uh, uh, Salvador Sanchez died at 23. He's an all-time legend. Okay. Asi De La Hoya was a three-division world champion at 23. Okay. So, uh, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. I don't think he gonna get no better. His style ain't get no ain't gonna get no more exciting. What? And de- it ain't. But listen, bruh, bruh, okay. hold on, 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 wait, 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 wait. Just I'm not, hold on. No, slow no, no, down. Let me finish. Oh, I'm not talking man, about Devin Haney. Let him finish. You talking about? You talking about? Wait, wait, wait. We're talking about them, them Paul brothers. They are not good. They are not good boxers. They're white, and that's why they're selling the way they are. Whatever, They're white. Whatever. When you're white, he when you're knocking white, them boys out. You He's good. sleeping them. He's sleeping them. Ain't nobody faking okay, them no, knockouts. Wait, wait, wait. Ain't nobody hold faking on, them knockouts. He putting in the no work. He putting in the work. He putting in the work. No, no, you gotta I hold on. That. You gotta hold on because hold on. I want it's you to show turn, me. Bernie. I it's want you to turn. show me a ten million dollar fighter. This 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 is this is waking up. They get punched in the face like Jake. Jake made forty five million, but he out here sparring motherfuckers to show you that he tough. Man, you crazy. Jake Jake more of a boxer. Jake more of a boxer than about ninety percent of these fools. He tough. He tough, but listen to this. Like I say, okay, Jake Paul, he the only person that knocked people out. Now who who he knocking out first? Now I'm listen, wait, we gotta put things in context. Any if you successful, you successful. But listen, what are we? What are, what is what is the the American public? What are we talking about? What's the public? They want nonsense. Like I say, I was just telling a guy like a guy like Troy, the Transformer. He was an Olympian, an American. Uh, he ain't they. He went top rank. Uh, like I say, they ain't pushing him. How many good fighters that they say they're not pushing? Why is he so popular, Bernie? And who is he not out? Bernie, you've been doing this for at least ten years. You know, that, you, know, so you know exactly why, who's a star, and who is not a star. You can't mention Troy and then question why he ain't being pushed. Where's his personality? He ain't even come out of his shell yet. Okay, okay. Okay, so listen. So, Jake Paul, he say stupid shit, and that makes him a star? No. Because what He say what confident else? shit. He sells confidence. He makes a list and say he could fight Tank and, and, and Canelo in five years. And people listen. He sells confidence. He don't sit there like 99% of his fight. Well, I let my hands do the talking. Well, I, you know, I don't, I don't get into all that, man. We're going to see well, him in the ring, man. But if he a star, who he will be? Bruh, no, you tell who me. Be? No, you, 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 uh, no. who, who, who your favorite who fighter? Who your favorite fighter? Don't say Crawford. Who? Who's your favorite outside fighter? Outside of Crawford? Yeah. Outside of, outside of Crawford? Yeah. Uh, I got a couple of them. Give me one. Shit. Never, re- never rest one of them. Who? I can't say Shakur because he's family. Oscar Navarrete? Emmanuel Navarrete. Emmanuel Navarrete? Don't go no further. Yeah. Don't go no yeah, further. He's one, he one of my favorites. Okay. Don't go no further. I, I love Navarrete. And, and uh, uh, like I say, who else it is? I love Bam. Bam, he's at the top of my list. Bam is at the top of my list, and be, along with the rest of them, Tay. Like I say, I like Dan, I like Devin too. I ain't got nothing to really against Devin, but I I don't I'm I'm not so high on Devin. Now is he a great talent? Is he super this and that and intelligent? Probably, but I don't I'm not keyed up to watch Devin Haney fight. That's just the truth about it. I don't care. He got nice clothes. He got pretty jewelry on. He a handsome guy, and he been winning. But I don't look to go see no Devin Haney. I don't see nothing in him myself far as like that. That's myself. a, that's a shame. That's a shame as a trainer. As a trainer, you trying to tell people that he not entertaining. And he's nah. a fucking master class boxer. Yeah. That yeah. shit was boring as fuck with him and Cambosis. Yeah. Uh, but, but, but listen to this though. Even, even the Canelo fight. 
as good as Canelo is and how how uh, different he knocked people out and shit like that. It, the fight was boring. You know, fights can be boring. Mayweather's can be boring. I, I watch Mayweather's to go to sleep. Mm -hmm. But he's beautiful. I like his stance. I like the way he throws his jab. I like his technique. But I don't really care for Devin's technique. Let me ask like you something. When you a fighter, is it the same to fight in front of 500 people and 5,000 people and 50,000 people? Is it all the same? Because I, I ain't no fighter. Same. I ain't no fighter, I, so I got to ask I you. I think it's the same. Oh, I you, think it's the same. I never had a chance to fight in front of 5,000 people, but I fought in a, in a small room, and then I fought on the big stage. So, I, I, like I say, I, I don't think it's no different. And what about if you met event, main eventing? I still don't think it's no 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 different because every fighter when he coming up he 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 sees himself as a main event fighter. Mm. So when you finally make it to that stage, just like anything, you're gonna be nervous. Where whatever you're doing, you're gonna be you know you want to do good. So I don't I don't think it's no different. But like you say, like a Shakur Stevenson or Devin Haney or a Bud Crawford or an Earl Smith, oh, yeah. you know they believe that they belonged on that stage. That's why they was able to go across the seas and perform the way they did. Coach, do you no. know do you know who Masael Ramirez is? Yes. No. No. I knew Miss Lopez. No. Misael Ramirez. No, I don't. Okay. Well, that's your favorite fighter's first fight ever, and he happens to be a Mexican that never fought before. So it was a debut fighter, a debut fighter. For Navarrete's debut, okay, uh, and then yeah. after that hey, he, tell your he retired. To keep it down, my guy. He retired oh, after that, okay. So, <laughs> so just to be clear, Navarrete's Navarrete's debut is a dude that retired. So basically, we know the promoter found him in the garbage can, took him out, let him fight him, put him back in the can. Do you know Mauricio Cruz? No. Mauricio Cruz was 0 and 2 and 1 when he fought Jesse Bam Rodriguez for the first time. And that was Jesse's debut. Okay. Okay. Mauricio Cruz. Okay, so Mauricio Cruz. Mauricio Cruz since the Jesse fight went on to win two more fights in Mexico but has since retired and that would he retired so, so, four years so, so ago what's your point no so what you saying about that oh i'm making my point i ain't done you heard of desi williams no go ahead what okay. is your point desi is owen four and he what and is he's your done point? nothing after what tank, is your point after tank debuted with him he did nothing he what retired. is your point well, the point is, you saying who has Jake Paul knocked out, right? I'm showing you who the fuck your favorite fighter knocked out. Who your favorite fighter for in his first four fights. And then I, then I showed you not just your favorite fighter, but the world's favorite fighter. In tank, and then I, then I'm showing you, then I'm showing you my favorite fighter in Devin. And then I'm gonna show you, and then I'm gonna show you Jake Paul, and you tell me who had it tougher, the dude that been fighting in front of thirty thousand on pay per view in his first five fights, or the dudes that been fighting nobody that retired in front of nobody. Come on, man, stop lying. Okay, now listen, hold on. We can't do it. Your man's too loud in the back. It's, it's way too much background noise. Okay, now listen. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. Now you said okay, who Jake Paul fights? So you want to defend this guy, but has he shown any fucking talent? <laughs> I I'm, I bet I bet. Now wait, hold on. You said about Never Red and this guy. Now you, I don't know who that guy fought, but he probably had a, a Mexican. Mexico is deep in rich boxing tradition, bro. Don't it's defend that. Fighter, Steve, hold on, wait. He hold literally on. retired after Navarrete. Don't defend that. Listen, I, listen. <laughs> he can retire all that he wanted. I don't. I don't care about that. But what did Navarrete go on to do? He went to go on and be a two division world champion and one of the most feared fighters in weight class. So, so what feared did Tank go on to do? Bro, what did Bill go on man. to do? Okay, now oh, oh, fight, hold, now, hold up, 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 hold up. Pretty good spin there. That was a pretty he good spin. He won one legitimate title and a vacant title. Okay, he beat one champion in 
Dog Bay, who also upset Magdaleno. Okay, so Dog Bay was not supposed to win. He was brought in from Canada to lose, from Ghana to lose. Magdaleno shit the bed, didn't take his, re actually lost in the rematch, and then Navarrete beat Mag um, a Dog Bay. Okay, after that, they gave him a vacant title that Shakur dropped, right? Don't forget that. Ain't, okay. He ain't fight Shakur. Okay. And he ain't want to fight Shakur when they tried to make the fight. It's public. Go look it up. Okay. So okay. don't act like now your man's this, this now animal. Listen. Now listen. He's been getting spoon fed. Because dog listen. ain't little as hell. Still. Little as hell. Still. Still. Emmanuel never read that thousand more skills than Jake Paul and, or Logan and guess what? Paul. And guess he what? He got a thousand more, and guess more, what? more fucking skills. Guess what else he got? Guess what else he got? 38 more fucking fights. Okay. You tell me what the rich Jake Paul going to do. He been training for four years, locked in in Puerto Rico with a team that no other body, none of these amateurs got in boxing. Don't nobody start 0-0 with the team Jake got. Don't nobody start 0-0 flying in legitimate uh, 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 spawn partners. Don't nobody start 0-0 holding a camp what you away mean you from home. Start, you start off in just like that. Man, you what crazy. do you mean you do start off with legitimate sparring partners? Man, you when, I was, when I was a kid, I was sparring with seasoned pros. When I was sparring, when I was sparring with amateurs that been around bruh, in the country. Bruh, what did you say? Bruh, bruh. What did you say? Don't. Don't do that when we know everybody that go to that gym. Sometimes y'all be spawning dudes the six and zero. Oh. That ain't no fucking season vet or no former world champ. And that's and you, that's it, and that's already you as an established. Champ that's, be already, that's already you as an. You not champ you not listening to me, man. You not listening to me. You just want to win an argument. You can't compare no, you a six and zero. Oh. You can't compare a six and zero oh fighter to Steve fucking Cunningham, a three time world champ. Who's showing you more? A three-time world champ or some dude 6-0 and that's from fucking Iowa or some fucking Kansas City? Knock it off, man. Knock it off. Don't don't, don't disrespect Kansas City like that. Come on, don't man. Jake Paul. Uh, Jake Paul is... Michael Nunn was from Jake Iowa. Did you Paul, know Michael Nunn was listen from to me. Iowa? Listen to me. Did Jake you know Paul Nunn is was paying Iowa? for legitimate no, sparring, man. Did you know man? Michael Nunn was from Iowa? Bro, so right, you pulling, you you pulling one Nunn champion is. from Iowa. Do you know who Michael Nunn you, is? Yo, you pulling you know one Michael champion. Nunn is? You pulling one champion right. from Iowa. How many champions come from right. Philly? How many champions come from Jersey? How many champions come from New York? Don't fucking talk to me about one fucking champion out of a fucking 100 years. Michael Nunn was from Iowa. You acting like Iowa produced fucking fighters. They don't produce fighters. Don't sit here and lie. Don't sit here it don't matter where you from. One, one fighter, you need to one fighter you make you produce. You what? need to realize it don't matter where you from. Why don't you piece it? of shit? Why don't fuck it? It don't matter because you from Philadelphia. Me, you can fight. Yes, it, it don't matter because you from yes, fucking, fucking California. Yes, me, you it can fight. Do. Yes, it fucking do. Yes, it fucking do. So now it oh don't matter. God. So now iron oh don't sharpen God. iron in your opinion no, either. Huh? Iron you don't sharpen iron. Man, hang up, man. You you can't win. You can't you win. You don't know no shit about no fucking Iron, boxing. Iron, so, so Bernie you the don't coach. Know no shit about no Bernie fucking the boxing. coach is telling the audience. Jake Paul, Bernie which he is the coach is telling man, the audience that Jake Iron don't sharpen Iron. That's, and, what, and, you and that's what you telling fight. us. That's what that you fight. telling us. That's what you telling us. We'll see. And, and, and we'll, see. Chico, man. we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. So you think he's going to be a world champ? Man, get the fuck out of here. He Bruh. probably don't get past Anderson Silva. Bruh. Get the fuck out of here. Ray well, Beltran. Ray Beltran. Ray Beltran became a world champ. What are you talking about, man? Well, world champ was way colder than uh, uh, Jake Paul ever gonna be. Bruh, you yeah. he just start following boxing, man. I'm done with this dude. You just start following the sport. J Jake Paul ain't never gonna be good as Ray Beltran. Okay. Okay. Never. Okay. Get the fuck out of here. Okay. I ain't saying that. We so gonna, what we saying we gonna, then? We going to stay in communication, and when the time come, you gonna, we going to bet against each other on Jake, because he going to keep dominating. Okay, well, then, hold on. Well, why didn't... Okay, didn't we just send him an offer to fight uh, Steven? Who's, I mean, Bud and Steven? Rick Ross talk. We even DM'd him or some shit like that. He picked Anderson Silva. Why you didn't pick Steven? Hey, Bo, if I got to tell you to hang up on this dude who don't know shit about boxing again, this motherfucker really asking us why he ain't picked Steven Nelson over Anderson Silva. Sit down somewhere, Bernie. Stop it, Because man. Because you, of his name? You're not, you not looking right thought, right now. I thought he was the sale. Not, I thought Jake Paul was oh, the sale. Oh, so wait a minute. Logan so Ball. wait a minute. So wait a minute. 
You, again, Coach Bernie trying to tell my audience that Jake is going to get more respect in the boxing world from fighting a dude that's been out the ring over a year and is now a, a, a director's position at BNB. So okay, he, get, on, he get more credit so for fighting an inactive about, boxer. Wait, no, no. So in you your said, opinion, wait, wait. he get more credit for fighting an inactive boxer who got a day okay. job. Sure, so, so sure, Bernie, Anderson sure, Silver sure, fall? When the sure. last time Anderson Silva fought? Oh, last I checked, I was at his fight in Florida where he fucking slept a legend. Come I'm on, Bernie. Saying, uh, bro, 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 why are you doing this? Bro, this y'all literally guy, right? talking to each other. He can't, I can't. Did he knock out an MMA guy? He can't hit. I'm asking you. Did he knock out an MMA guy? La this old, is the last question, no, Bernie. No, this is no, the last no, question. No, no, no. Did he knock out an MMA guy I'm, who was old, too? I'm going to answer your question, and I want did you to answer mine. Did he knock out an MMA guy who was old, too? I am going to answer your question, but Steven you Nelson must... Stephen Nelson stays in the gym. You must Steven answer Nelson mine. Nelson, we have him Answer mine. Steven I'm going Steven to answer Nelson yours. You NBA answer mine. All right, Bernie, 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 Bernie. Bernie. Exactly. He don't what want What has it. Silver won in boxing? No. All right. What has Silver won what in boxing? What has Silver won in boxing? Steven Nelson no. is an NBA I'm gonna, champion. I'm going to answer the world his. He got to answer mine. Steven Nelson was offered the world championship twice. And why ain't he take it? NBA why champion. ain't he take it? What has why ain't take it? Why ain't take it? If he was offered two title shots, why y'all ain't take it? Because I'm going to tell you like this. Oh! Because let him answer, oh, man. Let him answer. Let him answer. Let him answer. One at a time, fellas. Bernie, two titles. You've been offered two title you. shots. Oh, but you You've been offered two title shots, but you out here banging for a fucking fight with a YouTuber, huh? So who the real boxer? The real boxer want to fight look, a fucking you YouTuber. You say bitch ass shit like that. Oh, that's bitch ass, ass shit for see, telling you, you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. I'm telling you the truth. I'm the pussy for telling you the truth. I'm the pussy for telling you the truth. So listen, this is why I'm trying to tell I you. I love both this of y'all. You know what I'm saying? Y'all both. I'm a pussy now. I'm telling you the truth. Nah, chill out, Bernie. Chill out, Bernie. I'm a pussy for telling you the truth. You want a real fight? Fight a motherfucker who fights. No, no, no. Stick to the script. Stick to the script. Stick to the script. To the a division, amateur Stick a to the script. Amateur I'm a pussy because I'm telling a the truth. I'm a pussy because I'm not fucking so lying. Right. I'm a pussy because I'm not lying. Years old and we want to fight him. Hey, hey, guess what else? Guess what else? Guess what else? Guess what else, Bernie? And this going to fucking make your burn soul. No. Soul burn. This is going to make your soul burn. It's over. This is going to make your soul burn. Thank you, fucking Bernie. Fucking Anderson Silva got a better win on his resume than fucking Steven Nelson. He beat Julio Cesar Chavez, who was a former world champ. Nelson, they never did that. Don't you fucking debate with me. And, Steve, and who's that? Don't you Julio debate with me. Jr. was always Don't you above. debate with me. Julio you Cesar can't Chavez win. was always you above. You can't win. Julio you Cesar, can't win. You can't because win. Daddy, if Julio Cesar Chavez didn't have his daddy's name, that motherfucker wouldn't have been heard of. I, hey, yo. Now tell me that. All if you his do name was, is complain. If his name was Juan Perez, you wouldn't give a fuck about it. Mm -hmm. Now tell me that. He was you a world champ. Tell me Oh, oh, but you, you, but you respect, but you, you respect Ray Beltran, but you respect Ray Beltran, but you respect Ray Beltran, but you respect Ray Beltran. Who, who became a world champ? Who, who the Nobody fuck, who the fuck Ray Beltran be for the champ? Who the fuck Ray Beltran be for the title? Huh? Huh? Hold on. Huh? I'll tell you who. No, I'm going to tell you who. I'm going to make, make your soul burn again. All three fighters fought for vacant titles. Julio Cesar Chavez, Ray Beltran, and Terrence Crawford. I got the shit to okay. make your soul burn okay. slow. Okay. You you can't make my soul burn, you bum. Yeah, Listen, all right. Okay, bum. Yeah, all right. fight for one vacant look, title. Look, why you, you on board? Why you on board? I don't even talking about Jake. Why you on board? I don't even talking about Jake. All I do is spit facts. So, all I did was spit facts. The title, so? Facts. So? Facts. You talking about who Beltran beat? No. Beltran I'm talking about who Chavez beat. 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 That guy saying, was a I'm saying Chavez, I'm saying Chavez, I'm saying Chavez right. became a champ. Right. I'm saying Chavez right. became, right. became a champ. Bernie, like Beltran, I can't wait to champ. have you back, Bernie. It was very entertaining. Uh, the you the still chat going that. crazy. You still ain't said that. You know what I'm saying? We Beltran got 857 watching right now. Thank you, Who Beltran beat? Who Beltran beat? Who Beltran beat? Thank you, Bernie. Who Beltran beat? Who Beltran beat? Who he beat for that belt? A vacant title? Who 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 Chavez beat for a belt? A vacant title? So now all of a sudden it don't matter. Now 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 vacant title ain't ain't good. But 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 Crawford won one. Like let 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 let's be fair, bro. Let's be fair. I'm gonna defend Jake to the end, cause there's a lot of fucking haters out here. 
There's a lot of haters out here. My man tried to compare a spa partner from Kansas City to Steve fucking Cunningham. You can't compare that. Steve getting paid top dollar for being a three-time world champ. You can talk all that crazy shit if you want, but ain't nobody coming out here. Look, we got silver medalists that don't bring in world champions for sparring, bruh. Knock it the fuck off, man. I'm going to tell the truth. Oh, I'm going to tell the truth. So where, where was the vacant title? Who he fought for the vacant title? Oh, was it? Was it? No, don't tell me that. Don't tell me they gave him the belt versus Moses Paulus. Man, I should end the show. Nah. I should got, end the show. We opening blocks. So you telling me up. So you telling me that Ray Beltran won his belt over Moses Paulus. WBO World Light Vacant Super Man, this is damn shit. Let me screenshot. Anybody this. else want some of that Ness smoke? Cause he cooking today. Shout out Bernie, my guy. Anybody else want some? Number is one four two five five six nine fifty two forty one. Press one one time. And that's the thing, people get biased. You see that? People get biased. You tell me your favorite fighter is Navarrete, I show you he ain't done a motherfucking thing. It don't matter. But when it was Jake, he fighting nobodies. When I show you Tank ain't fighting nobody in his first five fights, it don't matter. But when it's Jake, he ain't fighting nobody. Meanwhile, somebody explained to me the logic behind the pressure of an 0-0 fighter on an undercard when nobody there, because don't nobody care, versus the main event on pay-per-view like Jake. Like, again, the hatred is there because Nick, they ain't never done what he done. So they mad. They ain't never done what he done, so they mad. You feel me? I got breaking Tank, news, Ness. Tank, Earl, they the only ones in the league of their own. They the only ones that went on pay-per-view and never came off. Even Floyd went on pay-per-view and came off. Even Canelo went on pay-per-view and came off. Tank, Earl, <laughs> pay-per-view trail. Jake started with pay-per-view. Started. First pay-per-view he ever did, straight to YouTube. I don't need nobody. 1.5 million, $10 a pop. Pop, pop, pop. But they gonna hate on Jake, but I'm gonna be right here to tell you all the truths about Jake. And when he lose, he lost. When he lose, he lost. But we ain't gonna discredit him and say he less than when he doing more than. He definitely doing more than. <laughs> <laughs> we got a counterpunch from CYP. Bravo, bravo. Uh, Thank Rob you, my Bo. friend. Thank Let me you. Tell you something, man. Yo, if, listen to me. Y'all already know I'm me and Nestor Dan. I'm starting to realize from this chat and the way y'all was responding, y'all don't like me and y'all don't like me. And this ain't about Ness versus CYP. Y'all don't like us because he was whooping that dude ass in that debate, and y'all know he was, but y'all still was riding with Bernie. It's just, it's just tell me about y'all. Y'all are some disloyal. I'm putting cases out on all you TV, D chat motherfuckers. I'm putting cases out on all of you. Y'all gonna be watching Bud versus Pitch and Pelican Bay. Listen to me. I'm dead serious. Good job, man. You know what I'm saying? I, I, look, if y'all think that's what's wrong, call in and tell him why he was wrong. I bet you won't do it. Because you know he was right. This dude tried to say Lomachenko's a goddamn superstar, but he failed every single superstar test. You ain't got to be from America to be no superstar. You ain't got to just be Mexican to be no superstar. He's not a superstar. Just because you like somebody. Don't, don't let your life for somebody make you a goddamn idiot. Bernie, I don't know you, so I can respect you, but I'm going to tell you something. I'm proud of Ness. Ness didn't call that man out his name one time. Not once. And I was like, damn, okay. He growing up. That's why Ness won the debate. CBV out. Let's go. <laughs> Appreciate it, champ. I, I just don't get it. You know, I, I didn't even... I don't know what it is, what it is. You know, he'll be back and the debate will continue because Jake might lose. Let's be real. It's not like I said. Bernie just said. Hold on. Let me make sure I read it. Jake clearly. might lose, man. It's not like I said. Bernie said, tell my boy it's all good. Appreciate you for having me on. Of course. This much love, Bernie, forever and always. Of course. And that's the difference it with me. It like, the chat. I, it'll spark never. Ness. You will spark. I will spark. And it'll. And it'll never get serious with me where I like, yo, Bo, don't ever bring him on. Like, Cause it's I'm boxing. Not, we talking about yeah. boxing. It's a straight up boxing hell debate. Yeah. People talking about, oh, and pull up on you. I'm gonna smack you. And it, it gets heated. Net. It gets heated because we love these fighters. 
You know, even if you don't want to admit it, you know you do. That's why you type what you type and you say what you say. Because secretly, secretly, you know you love these motherfucking fighters. And when they ain't doing what you expect them to do, and you get into defense mode, that's your love showing for itself. What up, YouTube family? Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe to the YouTube channel. Help us get to that million subscribers. We're on the road to a million. And obviously, we have other great content on our Patreon channel. So since this video is over, head on over to our Patreon and check out all the exclusive content or right here on our YouTube members.